rise royals all right let's go in and let's see what's going on inside of your connection okay this reading is going to be for my twin flames i cannot tell you guys how many messages how many emails uh how many of you guys are reaching out to me asking me you know questions like you know, am I going to ever get back with my twin flame? Am I manifesting them? Is this going to come to fruition? So I decided to do a video because with so many of you, excuse me, <clears throat> my voice is going out. Wow. It was so many of you asking the same question. So I felt like this was very necessary. Okay. So I do want to go in. I want to see, you know, um, are you manifesting your person back in, right? How um, are you manifesting your person back in? And uh, later on, I guess we can go ahead and pull some messages from your person, okay? And maybe even a dedicated song, okay? So yeah, I'm excited because you guys, I am going to be using my mother's deck today okay this beautiful look how big it is y'all look compared to my hand look at that huge okay this is my mother's deck this is the uh next world tarot deck i absolutely love this deck i remember the first time she got this deck this was before i was even doing readings and, you know, she did some readings on us and the shit was on point. Um, just to give you guys a little backstory, my mother and my father both have gifts, okay? Uh, my mother, I would personally call her a psychic. I don't think that she would call herself a psychic, but she definitely has very strong, very beautiful uh abilities to uh, go inside you know past present and future okay and pull out some shit she's able to communicate with different spirits okay my father my father can put together uh synchronicities numbers like nobody's business he will explain them to you and have your damn mind just blown okay he can also astro project all right so yeah just to give you a little backstory you know uh, you got those two and then they made me <laughs> and the rest is history okay but yes again i'm going to be using my mother's deck i'm very uh honored that she let me take this deck and, and she's letting me put all my good energy up in this <laughs> I'm sure she'll cleanse it later. But uh yeah, I'm 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 grateful that she let me do that. You know, if if you guys know anything about handling tarot decks, you normally don't let people touch your decks, okay? But I'm mommy's girl, so hey. <laughs> I get special privileges. Let's hop into this shit, okay? My twin flames, this is for you, all right? Um I tell you guys all the time, this is only for the people that know that they are in twin flame connections. I'm not talking about a soulmate connection. That is something totally different. Okay. I am not talking about a relationship with somebody that you just feel a very strong bond with. I am talking about a twin flame connection. Okay. A soul that came here, incarnated here. All right. Split into two right here to elevate consciousness okay with love let's keep going are you manifesting your person back in Ooh, you know what actually i want to see where you're sitting what energy are you sitting in okay because that's going to say a lot spirit what energy is my royals sitting in what energy are they in? Mm, the way this deck feels, I just love it. I promise you. I'm going to get this deck. I can't find it. 
See, I'm not looking hard enough. What energy are they sitting in, spirit? I think I got a damn mosquito in here. I'm getting ate up. I had my window open. Oh, itching. Okay. What energy, spirit? starting off damn strong come on now look at this you guys you are sitting in magician energy oh let me put this deck down real quick when i tell you you guys <laughs> this is beautiful energy right here what i'm getting from this is that you are very very um you're very at peace. You're very at ease with yourself. Okay. Beautiful, beautiful energy, earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay. This could be your sign. All right. You're at peace with everything here. Right. I think uh, you've gotten to a point where you're just like, I'm just going to let this shit do what it do, okay? <laughs> I'm going to let this shit fall in place the way it needs to fall in place. Uh, I feel like you're being more patient. I feel like you're being more gentle with yourself. I feel like you're loving yourself more. Somebody drinks coffee here, okay? Somebody is definitely a traveler. Somebody likes to travel a lot. Okay, somebody here could definitely be a backpacker. Somebody here likes knowledge. You feed on knowledge, okay? You're very knowledgeable. You're very smart, very intuitive, very intelligent. Okay, wow. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Somebody may live in a really big city. Okay. And I hear that somebody likes to sit under a bridge and just contemplate, meditate maybe on life. Okay. That may be very specific to somebody. Let's keep going. Wow. That was already deep. I'm telling you. Whoo. All right, what energy is my really sitting in spirit? What energy? What energy? Mm, 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 mm. The queen of pentacles, baby. Let's go. Let's go. You are focused, okay? You are focused on your dreams. You are focused on your aspirations. You are going to get it in this lifetime. Whatever it is, you're going to receive it. You know why? Because you have your eye on the prize here. You have your eyes on the prize. You can already envision, you can already see where you're going to be, okay? Somebody may also be a plant mom or a plant dad, okay? You love to be barefoot. Wow. Mm. The queen of pentacles is... Uh, you could be even married here, okay? <laughs> you could be married. Right? but unhappily married, okay? Trying to manifest someone back in here, okay? Your divine masculine. You're trying to manifest manifest this uh, connection with your person, okay? That's just gonna be for some of you. For those of you that's not married, you just gonna be looking real good. That money gonna be looking real good real soon. Let's get one more energy spirit. What energy are they sitting in? The Knight of Wands, okay? Ooh. Hmm. Knight of Wands. Creativity, right? Being very creative about something. Okay? And it's a lot of things that I feel like you want to do. 
okay but i feel like there's maybe one thing that you're focused on right now i feel like you have a lot of um a lot of creativity when it comes to a lot of things there's just a lot of things that you know how to do and you know how to do it well right but there's one particular thing that you're focused on there's one thing that spirit is guiding you okay to do okay you're an artist right you're an artist you 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 can take a canvas and create something very very beautiful here okay and i'm even talking about in your situation with your person right you're the magician you're the one painting this canvas okay and you're painting it well okay this is going to be one masterpiece this is what i hear from spirit this is going to be one damn masterpiece after it's all said and done oh we got two birds in this picture okay so i believe that that's just symbolic of you and your twin flame okay so we got the queen of pentacles can y'all see that and then we have the knight of wands okay hmm the Knight of Wands can also talk about um, like in, out, in, out energy. For some of you, you know what I'm saying? You've uh, you've been dating and just kind of just, <laughs> you know, dating and, and, and moving on. Dating and moving on because you have your mind set on one person, right? It's nothing really too serious here going on with you and these other people right so it kind of looks like you have flighty energy like you don't know where you want to be <laughs> okay that's just going to be for some of you now let's go into are you manifesting your person okay so let's put these over here this is the energy that you're sitting in as of now are you manifesting your person let's see spirit are they manifesting their person Okay. Hmm. So I feel like, okay, so you got the devil card that came out here, okay? This could definitely talk about holding on to like a lot of, um, hmm, what is it called? A lot of uh, uh, obsession, right? A lot of obsession. <laughs> Okay, so a lot of you are sitting in a, a, a bit of a borderline obsession with your person, okay? A bit of a borderline obsession, but I do feel like this is being mirrored back to you. I feel like your person is definitely borderline obsession with you as well, right? There could have been a lot of chaos going on in someone's world. Okay, I feel like this is this was definitely your person's world. Your person was sitting in a lot of chaos here. Okay, it was just so much going on in this person's life. Okay, I see children here. I see a female figure. I don't feel like that's your energy. I also see an older man. Hmm. Hmm. There is some deception here, right? When it came to your person. Money was a big factor. Okay. Hmm. You guys talked a lot about uh huh. Like outer world things. That's what I'm picking up. Outer world things. And somebody has a lot of friends or a lot of family, a big ass family. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going. The lovers. Yes. 
Are you manifesting your person that just confirmed it? Okay. We got the devil card out here and we got the lovers. Are you borderline obsessed with your person? Hell yeah. Is your person obsessed with you? Hell yeah. Okay. So yes, when the lovers flew out here, I already knew. Okay. Spirit is saying, yes, you, you are manifesting the hell out of uh, your person coming back, right? You're manifesting this like crazy. You know what I'm saying? I see you transforming. You're loving yourself. I said that at the beginning with the magician card. You're being very, very gentle with yourself, right? I feel like somebody at some point in time was very self-conscious about their body, right? Maybe somebody has a limp, okay? This could be you or your person, Okay. Somebody also changed their hair. Right? Just really embracing themselves, okay? This is this you loving yourself and embracing yourself and working on yourself is what ultimately brings us back together again, you guys. I tell you guys this all the time. You know what I'm saying? It's up to you. It's really, truly up to you. Let's keep going. Are you manifesting your person back in here? We already know the answer to that. Hell yeah. Look, we got the nine of cups, baby. <laughs> Woo. We got the nine of cups, okay? That is a damn wish fulfillment coming straight from the universe, okay? Okay. That is the universe letting you know that the universe has been listening this whole time, you guys. The universe hears you. The universe has been putting in place everything, okay? This has all been uh, worked out, <laughs> right? This has all been divinely guided, right? You about to be sitting in so much happiness, okay, with your person that is going to be ridiculous. You're going to be like, I don't even know how this shit came back together, but this shit came back together and I'm happier than I was before, right? Mm, I see a lot of abundance here, right? You're going to be eating very, very well, <laughs> right? Healthy. You're going to be eating very healthy. Thank you, spirit. Okay. Wow. A wish fulfillment is coming your way. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Let's keep going. I don't even shit. I don't even know where the hell go to go from here okay because we've already answered the question yes you're manifesting your person back in okay let's see if um let's see mm, i want to go into where's my deck where is it hold on you guys oh there it is I want to see what else is coming your way. Since Spirit is saying that this is a wish fulfillment coming your way, you're manifesting your person back in here. I want to see like what 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 type of shit is going to be coming in here. You know what I'm saying? What type of happiness you got coming in? <laughs> right? What type of happiness do you have coming in? What type of happiness are you manifesting when it comes to your person okay because when this person comes back in this is how you're going to feel right i mean you already feel good but shit your person come back coming back in ready is just going to be the icing on the cake baby okay look at this closer than you think i can't 
Ooh, channel this shit, spirit. Spirit said, this is closer than you think. Keep going. It's going to be a surprise when this person comes back in. I don't even think you're going to see this shit coming. You know what I'm saying? I don't think you're going to see this coming because I feel like for a lot of you guys, you've been manifesting this person back into your life for so damn long that you're really not even just focused on them. I mean, you're manifest. It doesn't make sense. You're manifesting them, but you're not focused on them. It's just kind of like you've got them in the back of your mind. They're still on your mind, but in the back of your mind. You know what I'm saying? Right in the back of your mind. They're still on your mind. But you're not going to see this shit coming. And Spirit is saying this is closer than you think. Okay? So a lot of you need to start getting excited, baby. Because it's coming. Okay? It is coming. <laughs> I was going to... I was going to tell y'all something personal, you guys, but I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready to to spill those beans yet. We'll see. We'll see. You know, you know, it's because it's one of those things. The twin flame journey is so jacked up sometimes. You'd be like, shit, I done spilled the beans and the shit didn't even go the way I wanted it to go. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just like, I'm going I'm to let it, I'm going to let it, I'm going to let it do what it do. And once I know for sure what the hell is really going on here then i'll drop the bomb on y'all okay but let's keep going but the shit that i have to tell y'all i already been knowing this okay spirits already been telling me this you know and i feel like spirit is telling y'all the same thing you know listen to your intuition you can't go wrong if you listen to your intuition right i'm just here to be a guide to what you already know to what you are already intuitively feel right i can't give you the answers i can only help you see okay let's keep going oh we got robin out here okay somebody's been seeing a lot of birds okay a lot of birds are coming through these are messengers Okay, and I feel like you are getting the messages. <laughs> you're getting the messages, honey. You picking up the call for sure. You ain't you. You're not missing that phone call from your spirit guides or your ancestors or your angels or your diamonds. Okay, at all. Okay, at all. Okay, they're comforting you. All right. Some of these birds may be loved ones that have passed over. OK. Talking to you. This is them coming through the reading, letting you know that you're manifesting exactly what you want. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. You're manifesting exactly what it is that you want to see in this lifetime. OK, let's keep going. Mm, baby, Oh, when I tell you. This sanctuary and this nine of cups is literally the same damn thing, okay? I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this is how you're manifesting your masculine back in here by healing, right? You have healed a lot, divine feminine. I'm glad you're not being so hard on yourself anymore because I feel like at some point in time, you were really beating yourself up over this, right? You were really telling yourself, you know what I'm saying? Blaming yourself for how things went down here, you know? And I just really, I'm, I'm, I don't even want to get emotional because I know what that feels like. You know what I'm saying? To really just be in... Um, the energy where you're just like I know I'm worthy of this shit I know I deserve to be loved right and I know I'm going to get it and I'm going to keep going because my ass will start crying because I'm a cry baby anyway uh, um yes like I was saying 
You have healing here. You have nine of cups here, right? You have safe haven is here, okay? You're definitely creating a safe space for your person. They love this about you. They love to come to your safe haven, I'm telling you. Right? Look, we got reflection. I told your ass that y'all both were mirroring each other. Right? Spirit said, be still. This is what you've been doing, though. You've been at peace. I said that at the beginning. I'm telling you, this magician card, that first card that came out, gave me everything that I needed to know here. Okay? Everything that I needed to know. You've been still. You've been at peace. Right? You've been letting things just unfold the way they need to, to unfold. Let's keep going. Oh, you got two cards that popped out. We got Mermaid. Oh, somebody may be pregnant. What the hell? Who the hell is pregnant? Mm, patience. I told you, you just got to be patient. Okay. And if you're not pregnant, your divine masculine wants to get you pregnant. Huh. Yeah, baby. They want to get you pregnant. They want to seal the deal. That's what I'm hearing. Seal the deal. Mm-hmm. What else, spirit? We got the ego here. Vision. Oh, my God. I can't. I said at the beginning, you got your eye on the prize. Right? Your higher self is leading you, guiding you. Right? Giving you these magician powers to manifest this shit. Right? To manifest your person. Mm hmm. I feel like somebody wants the truth when it comes to something, though. There's something that you want your person to admit or tell you the truth about. OK. Oh, baby. OK. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Where are we? OK, we're doing good. We're doing good. Let's see. Um. I wasn't prepared for this, you guys, because um, spirit always catches me like off guard. And when spirit catches me, I be trying to uh, <laughs> really like come to my workstation and get this shit out to you guys. You know what I'm saying? So forgive me if I am looking a little unprepared. See, I can't even go into that deck because I can't get it. Okay, Spirit said you got to get it. Okay, Spirit, hold on. Oh, excuse me, you guys. There we go. Spirit said you need that deck. Okay, let me make sure I got all the cards. There we go. Okay, hold on, y'all. Let me put this back. Oh, I got to get a little more organized up in this joker. I remember when I didn't have shit on my damn desk. Okay. All right. This is all for you. This is all for you, Royals. <laughs> How else are you manifesting your person back in since we already have the answer? Yes, you are. You're manifesting the hell out of this connection, okay? Somebody really, really, truly knows that they're going to be with their person at some point in time in this lifetime, okay? Okay. Let's keep going. Look at this. Happy damn family is out here. Look at this. I can't. Look at this. This is going to make somebody extremely happy, y'all. Oh, my goodness. You got a wish fulfillment. You got happy family out here. Like, I truly honestly feel like when you and this person come back together, Royals, Oh my goodness, it, it's going to be like, how or why did we ever let this much time go by? I know time is not a thing. I already know this. You know what I'm saying? But we also got to remember but that we are in these 3D bodies, okay? Still in damn reality. You know what I mean? 
and time very much feels real okay shit you want me to be honest it very much feels real but i mean it's, it's going to feel like why do we let this much time go by and it's also going to feel like time never went by right because you guys have so much love for each other right you're just going to be happy that you know what I'm saying? You were able to bring this together. You know, I feel like you guys have been trying to do this for lifetimes and lifetimes and lifetimes. And it just never quite got to where you wanted it to be. Right. Right. Maybe you guys were together in past lives. You know what I'm saying? But we don't know how how that went. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We don't know how that went. Let's keep going. Give me some more energy, spirit. What else? How else are they manifesting their person back in? Mm. Archangel Metatron is with you. Okay. So that's how. <laughs> I told you that you got some, some angels and some ancestors and all of that. But this right here is an angel. Okay. All right. And uh, Archangel Metatron is with you. Archangel Metatron is definitely guiding you here uh, in this twin flame connection. I'm hearing that somebody is 40 years old. Okay. Somebody just had a, a birthday. Happy birthday. Okay. All right. Let's keep going. Let's get another card. And then we're going to go ahead and hop into some messages from your person. Maybe get some time frames out here. Look at I'm done with y'all. I'm done with y'all. Whatever group this is that's here tonight. Okay. Hit that like button. Hit that like button for me. All right, because I feel you guys' energy very, very strongly. All right, I do feel like this is definitely the group, okay, that feels that they have a true twin flame connection, okay? This is beautiful. This person cares about you, okay? They do. This person absolutely adores you. This person is wanting to be with you, okay? Till the end of times. Damn, that's what I'm hearing. Okay. Let's keep going. Let's get some guidance real quick from Spirit. What's the guidance, Spirit? What is the guidance? What do they need to keep doing? Or what is the message? Don't let your past hold you back, okay? So that's a big message here. I feel like whatever went on in this connection, whoever hurt who, okay, we can't continue to play the blame game. I know that a lot of times we want our person to take some damn accountability. But truth of the matter is, if you want this to come back together, okay, you can't let the past hold you back. You can't let this person's past actions and, and unknowing, right, and lack of growth hold this connection back if this is really what you want. Okay, let's get, Spirit said, let's get one more card, okay? A time to give rather than take, okay? Right? Hmm. Yeah. I feel like this is for you. This is definitely for you, giving back to yourself. Okay, this is what you've been doing. Let's get some messages out here from your person. Okay, what's the messages, Spare? What is the messages from their person? What does their person want to say? What does their person want to say? Okay, what does their person want to say, Spare? You were not just a thing to me, okay? Mm. memories i miss you so much i told you this person cares about you okay all right a dream about you reaching out to me okay so this person is waiting and wanting you to reach out to them okay i have my eye on you Ooh. 
lot of peeping? Right? This person keeping tabs on you? Okay? Because you, you're, you're minding your business. <laughs> That's why you're minding your business. Okay, let's get some... Let me see if we can get some time frames out here. Hold on, you guys. Told you I wasn't prepared. Okay, let's get some time frames out here. Spirit, when could they be hearing from their person? When could they be hearing from their person? Okay. Two months. Boom. Give it two months, y'all. All right. Get it shit about two months. Okay. So it can happen anywhere in between now. This person could call you tomorrow. Okay. Keep that in mind. This person could call you today, tonight. Okay. Nothing is impossible here. All right, let's go ahead and get that channeled uh, song. Let's get that channeled song from your person. If your person could dedicate to you one song, what would it be? Oh, what would it be? Let it be a good one, Spirit, okay? Because you guys want to be together. I can feel it. I can feel it. It's just, it's just... <laughs> one of those damn things that you just cannot deny it's a connection that you just cannot deny you can run from this shit all you want to you know what i'm saying you can deny this shit all you want to you can be mad at your person all you want to but the shit's not gonna last it's not gonna last when this is a true twin flame connection huh, oh baby love trumps all what is the channeled song spirit what's the dedicated song the one song that their person could dedicate to them. What is it? If this song comes out one more time, this is so popular. I don't know what. It, look at this deck. And this Joker has come out all the time, okay? Aphrodite. That's what it is. Aphrodite by Rennie. It's a beautiful, beautiful song, you guys. Go look up the video. Listen to the lyrics, okay? You may have messages in there for you. These are the messages that came out, okay? If you resonated with any of this, be sure to hit that like button, okay? This is how you support me, you guys, on my channel, okay? It's the easiest way to support your girl. If you like these eight I was about to damn say 18 plus. Oh, y'all waiting for the 18 plus. Don't play. <laughs> it's coming. It's coming. I promise. Okay. If um, uh, if you like these videos, if you like the vibes here, okay, subscribe. Subscribe for more so that you don't miss out. It's your favorite goddess, goddess platinum. And I'm out. <laughs>